Japan's medieval castles, they're more than just historical artifacts. They are time capsules, where memories of yesterday speak to dreams for tomorrow. In this city, Aizu Wakamatsu, young people give up their lives to defend their castle. Today, it is a place of peace and calm, a place for contemplation and reflecting on the past. Meanwhile, the next generation prepares for the future. On this edition of Journeys in Japan, Tsuruga Castle, the iconic heart of Aizu Wakamatsu. The city of Aizu Wakamatsu lies some 200 kilometers north of Tokyo in the western part of Fukushima Prefecture. James Lambiasi is an American architect who lives and works in Tokyo. Aizu Wakamatsu lies on the edge of the fertile Aizu Basin. Tsuruga Castle stands on a hill, looking out over the wide plain. Japan's history had long periods of war between feuding regions. And through fierce competition, warlords would build huge structures to protect their domains. These structures were castles. For today's journey, I would like to explore Aizu Wakamatsu Castle. It's said that this castle represents a very important transition between samurai society and Japan's modern age. I'm really looking forward to visiting Aizu Wakamatsu Castle with you today. So let's begin. Wow, this is just magnificent. Today I get to meet someone who knows a lot about this castle. I think that's him there. Kondo san desu ka? Hai, Kondo desu. Konnichiwa. Yoroshiku onegaishimasu. Yoroshiku onegaishimasu. Kondo Masao is a curator at Tsuruga Castle. この石垣は見事ですね。はい。で、この石垣はあの今から400年ほど前に作られたもので、あの高さは20メーター以上もある。あのかなり大きな石垣になってます。それでその角度も下の方は斜めになって上の方は直立するようなすごく綺麗な作
切り込みはぎの石垣といいまして江戸時代の終わり末期の積み方になります石自体が直線的に切り込まれていたりなんかしてそういうのが特徴になりますでここに大きな石があるんですがこれは鏡石といって主人の威厳を示したりとか邪気が入ってこないようにというので設置されるというのが多いわけなんです So by standing here looking at the different types of walls, we're able to see how they evolved throughout history. Not only did they develop in terms of defense, but in appearance as well. The wall here is made of very thick stones, which prevents the outside air from getting in. この城には石垣しか残っていなくて残念だと思いませんかそうですねしかし木造建築を残すことは難しいですからねでも私たちの心には当時の思いがすごく残っているんですこちらは当時の時代の。Naginata were first used as battlefield weapons from around the 12th century. Thanks to their length, the opponent can be kept at a good distance. The head is used to attack the opponent's legs. These days, Naginata is a modern martial art with a focus on training the spirit. Historical accounts say that women warriors in Aizu sometimes join the battlefront with their Naginata. Even today, many women practice this martial art. ここでは礼儀などが学べて、日向の他にも学べる大切な場だと思っています。自分を成長できる存在だと思っていて、勝ち上がっていく力などとても感じられるので、成長を感じると思います。In the old days, this was the garden of the feudal lord who ruled Aizu from Tsuruga Castle. Oh wow, this is such a beautiful garden. I really do feel like I'm in Kyoto. This garden was also used for growing medicinal herbs. It dates back some 600 years. This land was originally the site of a warlord's villa, chosen for its abundant spring water. Later, it was developed into a garden for the feudal lords of the Matsudaira family, who ruled the Aizu domain. Standing in this Japanese garden, I'm stunned by the beauty, 
But you also have to remember that there's political motivations behind what we see. They were able to say, this microcosm of nature is our world, and we are able to control worlds as well. In the latter half of the 17th century, the Lord encouraged the cultivation of medicinal herbs to maintain the health of the local people. This is the type of ginseng known here as otane ninjin. Since ancient times, it's been considered the ultimate medicine. The lords of Aizu encouraged its cultivation. To this day, Otane Ninjin is known as a local specialty of Aizu. Shimizu Taku is one of the ginseng cultivators. All this area covered by black nets is a ginseng field. はい、土作りに2年で種をまいて5年経った この歴史途絶えさせたくないという思いがありますので、頑張って、え、仲間を増やして生産量を増やしていきたいと思っています。What is this? Imori Masanori is the owner of the Sazai Do. It still looks just the way it was when it was built 300 years ago. It evokes the spiral shape of a shellfish, and it's been designated an important cultural property of the nation. あの、取り外されてるんですけども、ちょうどこの位置に観音様が順番にあの、お祭りしてあって、ここでお参りをして、そして次に行くという。なるほど。ここに太鼓橋というのがありましてね、ここどうぞ登ってください。ここがこのサ
さっき登ってきたのはここという天井ですねこの下りの天井は上りの床になってますなるほどじゃあさっき歩いたところがこの上なんだすごいね Thanks to its double helix structure, the stairway to the top is quite separate from the stairs leading down. Some European church towers have a similar double helix structure, but Sazaido is unique in Japan. You can hear the footsteps of the people walking above. This building really is amazing how the, by separating it into two layers, the people going up and down are entirely separated and they never have to cross paths. It really is a uh, technological wonder. Here it is. こんにちは猫ちゃんこんにちは<笑>はいようこそいらっしゃいませこんにちはこんにちはお一人様ですかそうですねはいそうです、ね、どうぞメニューもご覧になってください当店のお蕎麦は西会津の在来種を石臼で引いた引きぐるみのお蕎麦ですこの時期は暑いのでババナオブーミー runs this soba noodle restaurant with his family Baba is quite unusual in that he started his career in Italian cuisine. He even went to work in Italy. きっかけは外国に行った時です。日本人なのに日本のことを何も知らない自分がいて、でここに来た時に日本文化の一つであるお蕎麦、これを学べるいい機会だなと思ってこの道に入りました。In Japan, buckwheat has been eaten since ancient times, but the idea of cutting buckwheat dough into noodles began in the 17th century. The first lord of Aizu came from a region known for eating soba noodles and is said to have brought skilled soba artisans with him. The actual job of making and cooking the noodles is done by Baba's wife. While his mother in law cooks the tempura. And the family cat is there at the entrance to welcome customers. Hi, I'm going to go to the next one. I'm going to go to the next one. 天ぷらですおあ、色はちょっと普通より黒い感じですねじゃあいただきますうん。コシが強くて香りが高いんですねうん。Tempura with soba is always a popular combination, but it's very unusual to find herring fish prepared as tempura. Mmm. Soto ga saku saku de nakami wa fua fua desu ne. Oishii. Totto mo oishii desu. In the summer, people gather at a Buddhist temple in Aizu for an event. This temple, called Hachiyoji, dates back to the year 964. Todaimo Sanke no Shonin Kokoroda Sokoro Senzo Dai Dai Kakure Narabin Shinjak Shoryo Kuyo no Tami Ni Tsushin de Chato Kenje Ko Oshi Date Matsuru. This dance, Kuya Nembutsu Odori, is performed each summer. This Kuya Nembutsu Odori is a song that is written by the Kuya Shonin. The purpose of this dance is to 
お盆の前に皆様のご家庭にそれが帰る前にこの場所でそれら魂を鎮めるために踊っております。The origin of the dance goes back to a priest called Kuya, who lived in the 10th century. He used to pray for the spirits of those who died without any living relatives. Hachiyoji is thought to be the place where Kuya died. In the old days, people often used to dance as a form of prayer. However, the practice gradually faded after the temple was burnt down in war in 1589. But 100 years ago, the dance was revived. Now it's been designated as an important part of the local culture. People around the world of different cultures pay respect to their dead in different ways. In Japan, and especially here in Aizu Wakamatsu, it's very important to come together in August to pay their respects. This has been a very special opportunity for me. James has come to a site that was very important for the samurai warriors in Aizu. ここは日進館といって、江戸時代の武士のための学校です。あ、そうですか。When Nishinkan was founded in 1803, it offered the highest level of education in the Aizu domain. The current structure is a replica of the original. あそこに安置してあるのは格子像ではないんですかはい、そうです。Confucius was a philosopher who lived in China some 2500 years ago. 武士と格子は一体どのような関係あるのでしょうか会津藩の指定は10歳になるとこの学校に入学し、学問や武術に励み、肉体、そして精神の鍛錬に努めました。The teachings of Confucius underpinned the student's education. Confucianism preaches that the ideal society should be based on love and established rituals. In feudal Japan, this was considered fundamental for educating samurai. たくさんの科目を学びましたそして優秀な生徒ですと飛び級の仕組みもあったそうです Nishinkan was not only a place for academic studies The students were also trained in the martial arts They were given a full training in archery And they also learned how to use guns This pond, about 150 meters in circumference, was the very first training pool in Japan. The students are said to have swum among the water lilies. However, war broke out in 1868, and the Nishinkan was destroyed in the fighting. It was only rebuilt in 1987, more than a hundred years later. そうですね。会津の人にとってこの学校はとても大切なものでしたが、まあ、事情がありまして、復元するにはそれだけの時間が必要でした。The conflict pitted the forces of the new Meiji government against those of the ousted Tokugawa shoguns. The Aizu domain was on the side of the Tokugawa shogunate. It fought fiercely but was defeated.
That led to the downfall of the Aizu domain. Even though they were still teenagers, the young students at Nishinkan became involved in the fighting. They were assigned to a military unit called the Byakotai, but they were cornered and fled up to a mountain. As it became increasingly clear that the Aizu domain was facing defeat, many of the young men committed suicide. To this day, the site of this tragic event is cared for by the people of Aizu. Ah, so this is it. They killed themselves because they can see the castle from here. The death of the Byakutai, who were just children, truly is a testament to the futility of war. Every time I visit a castle town in Japan, I am impressed that the people I speak with have very strong thoughts and feelings about its history. And in Aizu Wakamatsu as well, even after hundreds of years, the culture and customs that were established here have remained deep-rooted and widespread. I believe this is because the castle has taken shape over time by heartfelt care and aspirations of the people who live here. Even if it represents painful memories, the people of Aizu Wakamatsu will still cherish their castle. The original wooden structure is now a castle rebuilt in concrete, but its long legacy still inspires its people. I hope you enjoyed exploring this castle town of Aizu Wakamatsu as much as I have, and that you join me for future journeys in Japan. To reach Aizu Wakamatsu from Tokyo, you take the Shinkansen to Koriyama, then change on to a local train. In all, it takes about three hours. <laughs>